Hello everyone. Welcome to another exciting episode of the My Tektra podcast, your go-to source for career insights in the world of technology. I'm your host Neha. The IT landscape is changing faster than ever. What was cutting edge 2 years ago is now commonplace. For students and professionals looking to pivot or specialize, the big question is, where should I focus my skills for a long-term successful career? To help us answer that, we have an industry expert with decades of experience in IT training and consulting. Welcome Mr. Arjun, it's great to have you on the show. Thank you Neha. It's always a pleasure to join My Tektra's podcast and share insights that help learners and professionals choose the right career path in technology. Great. So you've prepared a list of the top 5 technologies you believe are absolute game changers for an IT career right now. Let's dive right in. What's at number 1? Unsurprisingly, Neha. Number one is artificial intelligence, AI. And I don't just mean general AI. I'm talking about the entire stack. Machine learning, deep learning, natural language processing, NLP, and of course, the disruptive force of generative AI. We hear about AI everywhere. Why is it such a solid career choice? Because AI is shifting from being a specialized tool to a fundamental layer of all software. It's not a feature anymore. It's the core. Companies are scrambling for talent that can build, implement, and manage AI models. Roles like AI engineer, ML ops engineer, and data scientist are not just in high demand. They are commanding some of the highest salaries in the industry. This is a marathon, not a sprint. And we're only in the first mile. A marathon, not a sprint. I like that. So from the highly complex world of AI, what's your second pick? My second pick is a suite that's all about democratizing technology. The Microsoft Power Platform. I'm grouping Power Apps, Power Automate and Power BI together here. That's interesting. Many think of this as a low-code or no-code platform. Why is it a top-tier career? Exactly because it's low-code. It bridges the massive gap between business needs and IT bandwidth. Power BI is the leader in business analytics and visualization. Every company needs to understand its data. Power Apps allows developers and even non-developers to build custom business applications at incredible speed. And Power Automate handles robotic process automation, RPA, and workflow automation. The career here is as a power platform consultant or developer. You become the hero who solves complex business problems in days, not months. For any company invested in the Microsoft 365 or Azure ecosystem, these skills are pure gold. Solving problems fast? That's definitely a valuable skill. Now, your third pick is fascinating. It's the Adobe Experience Cloud, and you've listed tools like AEM, AEP, AJO, CJA, and RTCDP. Can you break that down for us? I'm glad you brought this up. This is a highly specialized and lucrative niche that many people overlook. We have moved from an IT economy to an experience economy. How a customer feels about your brand is everything. So this is MarTech or marketing technology? Precisely. But it's deeply technical. AEM is Adobe Experience Manager. It's a leading-edge content management system for large enterprises. The rest of the tools, AEP, Real-Time Customer Data Platform, AJO, Adobe Journey Optimizer, and CJA, Customer Journey Analytics, are all part of a single platform that creates a complete real-time profile of a customer and allows brands to personalize their experience across every single touchpoint, from the web to email to mobile apps. The demand for Adobe experience developers and architects is staggering and the talent pool is very small. It's a fantastic area to specialize in. A small talent pool and high demand always equals a great career. Moving on, your fourth pick is one that's critical for everyone, cybersecurity. You've specifically highlighted CyberArk and SailPoint. Yes, cybersecurity is non-negotiable. As companies move to the cloud, adopt AI and build more apps, their attack surface explodes. But I want to focus on a specific high growth area within security, identity and access management, IAM. What does that mean? It's about answering two questions. Who are you? That is identity. And what are you allowed to do? That is access. CyberArk is the leader in privileged access management, PAM. It locks down the keys to the kingdom, the admin accounts, the root passwords that if compromised could lead to a catastrophic breach. SailPoint is a leader in identity governance. It manages and automates who has access to what applications and data within a company. A career in IAM with skills in SailPoint or CyberArk makes you one of the most important people in any organization. The job security is practically absolute. 
Job security sounds pretty good. Okay, let's wrap up with your fifth and final pick, mobile app development using Flutter or React Native. That's right. The mobile first world won. Everyone has a smartphone and every business needs an app. But the old way of building two separate apps, one for iOS using Swift and one for Android using Kotlin, is slow and expensive. And that's where Flutter and React Native come in? Exactly. They are cross-platform frameworks. You write one set of code and it runs beautifully on both platforms. React Native from Meta Facebook uses JavaScript and the React library, which millions of web developers already know. Flutter from Google uses a language called Dart and is known for its incredible performance and beautiful expressive UIs. Startups and large enterprises alike are adopting these frameworks to save time and money. A skilled Flutter or React Native developer can build high-quality apps faster than anyone else, making them incredibly valuable in the market. Fantastic. So to recap, we have Artificial Intelligence, Microsoft Power Platform, Adobe Experience Cloud, Cybersecurity, specifically IAM tools, and cross-platform mobile app development. Arjun, that is a powerful list. What's your one final piece of advice for someone listening who wants to get started in one of these areas? My advice is simple. Don't just learn, build and get certified. These technologies are practical. A certification from Microsoft, Adobe or CyberArk proves you have the skills. And a personal project like building a small app with Flutter or an automation with Power Automate shows you have the passion. The combination of learning, certification and practical application is unbeatable. That's excellent advice. Arjun, thank you so much for sharing your expertise with us today. My pleasure, Neha. And to all our listeners, if you're interested in building a career in any of these top-tier technologies, be sure to visit mytectra.com for courses, certifications and expert-led training. I'm Neha and this has been the MyTectra podcast. Subscribe for more insights and we'll see you next time.